Katie Chats here at the Regent Park Film Festival in downtown Toronto with Tony Del Rio, who works with Youth, Youth for Change, and you're co-presenting here at the festival. How did you hear about Youth for Change? Uh, well, Youth for Change is actually with a U for Change, oh. not Youth, I don't know, it's a oh. stickly thing, sorry about okay, that. No, that's okay. um, well, I heard about it through uh, one of my good friends is Chalo uh, Barawetza, who is the executive director. And, uh, you know, he told me about this great organization and I was working in the field and he kind of plucked me to, uh, to this organization to run the social enterprise. And what kind of work do you focus on? Uh, we focus on, it's an arts program for newcomer youth. So newcomers 14 to 29. And we try to engage uh, the youth through the arts. So we teach dance, uh, film production, uh, web design, photography, um, music. Uh, a whole, a whole, anything artistic that will bring in the youth, that's, that's what we do. And how did you come to co-present here at the Regent Park Film Festival? Uh, it's a pretty uh, easy uh, partnership. We actually have a, uh, a space in the third floor at the same building, uh, Regent Park. We are at the CSI Regent Park as well. So it was a very nice synergy between our video department and their film festival. And then Richard, who runs the Regent Park Festival, and Chalo got together and was like, you know, let's, let's work together. Let's bring our video department out to see what the other people in the community are doing. And what is the importance of arts for you in various communities? Uh, that's a question. I guess for me personally, the, the arts, it, it's a proven model. The arts lead to um, enriched, more productive lives especially with young people. Um, the more involved they are in the arts means that more of their time is spent on something productive. And young people love to waste time, right? They, they love it. So the arts gives them a really nice outlet to express themselves. And where is the best place to find out more information on You for Change? Uh, I guess the website would be youforchange.org. Uh, that would be the best uh, online resource to check us out. Thank you so much, Tony, and enjoy the festival. All right, thank you. Thank you. I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats here at the Regent Park Film Festival in downtown Toronto.